Welcome back to Foxtech. Today, I'm gonna to show you how to remove objects from photos on your iPhone. Sometimes you take a great photo, but there's something in the background you wish you could just get rid of. Maybe it's a person, a stray object, or something that just doesn't belong. Luckily, there's an easy way to do this with a free third-party app. Let's get into it. First, to remove objects from photos on your iPhone, I highly recommend using an app called Snapseed. This app is free to download from the App Store and it's made by Google, so it's trustworthy and has some great editing tools. Go ahead and download Snapseed if you haven't already. Once it's installed, open the app and import the photo you wanna edit. From there, you're going to wanna to navigate to the Tools section and select the Healing Tool. Now, the Healing Tool in Snapseed is super useful because it lets you brush over the object you wanna remove. Think of it as a small brush that you control with your finger. You just swipe over the area you want gone. Snapseed will then analyze the surrounding pixels and replace the selected area with similar textures and colors from the background. It's not always perfect, but in most cases, it does a pretty solid job blending the unwanted object with the rest of the photo. The way this works is pretty smart. Snapseed takes a look at the pixels surrounding the object and tries to match them up to fill in the area naturally. It essentially removes the object by filling it with the surrounding content, making it look like it was never there. This method works well for most photos, especially when the object is on a simple or consistent background. So if you're looking for a quick and easy way to clean up your photos, Snapseed's healing tool is probably your best bet. Of course, there are other apps that offer similar features, but in my experience, Snapseed is one of the easiest and most effective options for iPhone users. It's straightforward, does a good job on most images, and best of all, it's free. Thanks for watching. If you found this guide helpful, please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to Foxtech for more tips on getting the most out of your iPhone. See you later.